Hey what's up guys my name is Farjana welcome to my another element design related tutorial in this video i will show you how you can create this kind of particle effect with our images here i will show you how you can create different kind of effect like this particle effect snow effect and also here is some more effects we will see and then we can customize this effect from here as we need and finally we will apply all this effect inside our website like here i have applied this effect with image and also in the bottom area i have applied a different kind of snowfall effect with another image here i will show you how you can add this kind of effect with any image but following the same process we can apply the effect with any section like with any text any images or even with this full area here i am using the elementor pro version but this effect will also work on the free version of elementor and to create this effect i did not install any more extra plugin only need to add few line of codes so it will also will not affect your website speed by creating this kind of nice beautiful effect to your website you can also take your website to a next level all right so far you see if you think this tutorial adds some value to you please give this video a big thumbs up otherwise you may not find this kind of valuable tutorial next time and if you are new here like to see my more upcoming videos don't forget to subscribe my channel now let's go ahead and without any further ado let's get started first i'm taking a new section and here i'm taking two column structure now this is the canvas mode for this page and I'm taking a full screen height so going to edit section and height I'm taking it to fit to a screen and here I'm setting the background color to a dark color going to style tab and background color and now in the left side I'm taking a image and in the right side I'm taking some text so click on the plus icon and taking an image and here i'm going to upload the image and on the right side i'm taking some text this is basic layout here i have added some normal text a title text and a separator so if you know about the elementor you can make this kind of text and now i'm going to add some effect with this image so in the new tab i'm going to search for particle js and going to this website particles.js and from here we will find different kind of effect this is the default effect and we can also customize the effect from here here is the particle number we can change the numbers colors shape size and all this and also here is some different kind effect like if we go to the next nasa we can see it's a different effect then bubbles and snow effect so we can take any kind of effect i'm going to the default one for now and also if i go to particles going to numbers here is the value we can decrease the number of particle and density we can also change it then color by default this is the white color we can change the color and shape this is stroke polygon and also we can even add any image instead of this circle shape we can change the circle shape from here this can be triangle polygon star you can see the small icon is changed to a star icon or even we can add any image instead of this shape then size we can also decrease or increase the particle size that's cool so by customizing all this effect we can create different kind of cool shape or cool effect and we can apply all this to my website all right and also here is some more options like opacity you can change the opacity then line linked interaction we can set some effect on hover on click or modes like here on hover this is the repulse so when we hover over it's moving to different direction that's cool also there is bubbles grab if we select the grab we can see it's showing differently I'm going back to repulse. 
all right i'm done and now i want to apply this effect to my image so if i go to code pen and from here i can copy the js code before that i need to copy some html code so from my website i'm going to copy all this html i will also leave this page link in my description so you can check it from there and now i'm going to my website and here i'm taking a new widgets searching for html and i'm taking this element below this image now paste our code and here we have to put the js code for particle js so going again to here and select all these js going to copy and paste here now to apply all this code simply copy the name from top of the code particles js i'm going to copy and now for this image going to edit going to advance and css id i'm going to paste it here and when i save this page going to preview changes we can see the particle effect is showing but here is a little bit problem we can see the effect is showing also a little bit off of this image so to solve this i'm doing this in a different way i'm going back here i'm removing this image going to delete and now going to edit column going to advance and i'm going to apply the css id with the column and here inside this column i'm going to add some spacing so for that searching for spacer or here is the spacer i'm taking this and now i'm going to increase the spacing i'm making it to 350 or you can make it to 550 and now for this column i'm changing the background image going to edit column going to style tab and background image i'm going to upload the same image which i wanted to add i'm going to add this image now you can see the particles is showing over this column that's cool now saving this page and also checking it from this preview page and we can see it's looking very cool and now in the same way i'm going to duplicate this section and now this time i want to add a different image and also want to apply a different kind of particle effect with this image before that i'm just moving the column and also changing the background image for this column changing the position to center center and the size making it to cover all right and now i want to add a snowfall effect with this image so first i'm saving it and again going to particle.js and from here if i go to the snow and without any customization let's see we are going to add this effect directly with our image so click on this code pin from top and now from here select all this js code going to copy and here going to the html code if i don't find it click on right click go to navigator and here is the html and instead of all these js i'm just simply removing all these js and here going to paste my new code and here i'm changing the name particle js to particle js2 and then going to edit column going to advance and add the css id to particle js2 and when i save it go to preview image and for the second image we can see here is showing the snowfall effect that's cool so the first image we show a different effect and also the second image showing a different effect and in the same way we can add different kind of or customized effect with our images all right hope you understand the basic concept how we can use the particle effect or how we can customize it and finally how we can apply this effect to our elementor website the same effect we can apply to any sections even with any text or any area that's all for today if you like this video give this video a big thumbs up otherwise you may not find this kind of valuable tutorial next time and if you are new here like to see my more upcoming videos 
don't forget to subscribe my channel. And finally, if you like to work with me for any WordPress project, you can contact me through my website. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.